This week on Drive Time, Nissan Canton turns double digits, Altima gets its race on, and Leaf dominates worldwide EV sales. Nissan brought the auto industry to Mississippi in 2003 with the opening of its Canton manufacturing plant. Ten years later, Nissan has produced more than 2 million vehicles and generated $2 billion in payroll as the largest private sector employer in the region. Today, the facility has an annual payroll of more than $200 million and employs a diverse workforce of more than 5,000 Mississippians from across the state. This past weekend, the company celebrated with a huge party for employees and the community at the Mississippi Veterans Memorial Stadium in Jackson. Guests enjoyed a special musical performance by Grammy-winning R&B band Cool in the Gang while celebrating the accomplishments of the plant. Rick Kelly vaulted himself into 12th place in this year's V8 Supercars Championship after his best event of the 2013 season. It all went down at the stunning Circuit of the Americas facility in Austin, Texas, and his results confirm the Ultima as an emerging threat in the V8 Championship. On their way to the V8 Supercars debut event in Austin, race car drivers Rick and Todd Kelly, along with Michael Caruso, made a stop at the Nissan Americas headquarters and Smyrna Manufacturing Plant in Middle Tennessee. Smyrna is the largest car plant under one roof in the U.S. and produces over 550,000 vehicles per year. The star of Smyrna is the Altima, the same car used by Nissan in the V8 supercars. Nissan has signed on to sponsor Keiko Ihara, the only Japanese woman to race in the World Endurance Championship. She competes in the LMP2 class, and her golf racing car features a Lola chassis and a Nissan engine. When I was 25 years old, this is quite right, but I started in motorsport. The partnership agreement also means she will work with the company to promote diversity and the development of the infrastructure for electric cars. Big power uh, from the start, so I like that feeling, and the sound is very nice. Uh, not exhaust sound, but the electrical sound, I love it, so. This year, Ihara is due to compete at Le Mans 24 hours. The Nissan LEAF continued to make history by crossing the 25,000 sales threshold in the U.S., reinforcing LEAF's position as the world's best-selling electric vehicle. With more than 25,000 LEAFs in the U.S. and 62,000 around the world, the adoption curve for EVs is accelerating. There's tremendous interest in this car on the West Coast and in a number of new strongholds like Atlanta, Raleigh, Denver, Dallas, Chicago, and St. Louis. On Saturday, June 1st, Nissan turns its attention from four wheels to two and invites everyone to come on out and join the cyclists who are riding in the Harpeth River Ride in Franklin, Tennessee. The event begins and ends on the Nissan Americas campus, and the routes are all new this year, including 12, 24, 42, 62, and 100-mile rides. This year's Harpeth River Ride also features a family festival with fun and entertainment for the whole family. The festival includes a kid's zone with activities for all ages, a variety of foods and beverages, pro BMX demonstrations, a community expo showcasing healthy, active lifestyles, and music featuring live artists and bands. Visit www.harpethriverride.com for more information. That's all for this week. We'll be back next week with all the latest Nissan news. Remember to contact us. Drop us a line at nissanamericas.today at nissan-usa.com. Thanks for watching Drive Time.